Hey, hey, I'm Shar. Welcome to Readings. If you like the way I read, please like, share, and subscribe. If you're already a subscriber, welcome back. Thanks for joining me today, darlings. Oh man, there's some energy coming in here. Oh, oh, who am I picking up on? Welcome new subscribers. Thanks for joining us. I hope you find the answers that you're looking for here. Hope you find health and healing, friends and family. Pisces. Pisces. A lot of energy surrounding me right now. Who? Who? Wow, spirit's talking. Talking too fast. Show me a scenario. Someone out there, you want your person to come back. Afraid to look out the window in case they might be there. Want them to come back, but don't want to be seen. Don't want to be seen just in case they're there. What does that mean? Does that mean anything to you? Don't want to look out the window, just in case. I don't know, does your person live nearby or something like that, or a chance that you may see them, or... I don't know. I want them to come back, but afraid to be seen. What the hell does that mean? That means something to someone out there. Pisces, let's get her on, let's get her done, let's find out. If the reading is going to coincide with this, what's going on? You want someone to come and, and, cut and bring you an apology. It's the strangest thing. And what I... It's kind of like what I got here. It's like, you want someone to come and apologize, but there's some sort of fear here. What, what the hell is this? There's some kind of fear. Like, I want them to come back, and I don't want them to come back. That kind of thing. If they come back, it's going gonna, it's gonna to make me feel trapped. It's going to make me feel... It's just going to make me feel, you know? It, it's... It's going to bring me the sun. It's going to bring me the sadness. It's going to bring me the, the, the love. It's going to bring me the hate. It's going to bring me. It's going to bring me warmth and, and feeling good. And it's going to bring me. Deception and 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 feeling cold and. What the hell did this person do to you, darling? Damn. What the hell's going on here, Pisces? Who am I picking up on today? Okay, so I've got some, this person's younger than you, obviously. Here, there's a there's a lot of emotion in between the two of you, no doubt. Damn, but the, the, the two very very passionate people, two people that can't be together and can't be apart is what I got. There's a lot of emotion stuck in the middle here, and the emotion is there seems to be some sort of not so much fear, but what is it, spirit? What is it? It's, it's not a fear. It's a, damn, I wish you guys could talk to me and give me a word. Because I know, I know there's someone out there that got the word for it. And I wish, oh, I should be live right now. Damn. All I can do is just keep going and, and hope that it, it that you understand. Because I'm trying to understand. You're hiding out from this person. You're hiding out from them. Just, you could have possibly have been married to them or, or you lived with them. Or you wanted to marry them. Because I definitely have two sets of wands here. But one, one is younger. 
and I want to say it's them. I feel it's them that's younger than you. Now, there is great potential that the two of you can work on this. It appears that you both can work on this. Somebody's childish here. Either you or them, but Pisces, I don't know. Somebody's is, is quite childish here. Somebody can be uh, quite childish in their emotions and, and tend to uh, run. We got a runner here. We got a ghoster, a runner. Be childish sometimes. Immature. We got a much more. See, now again, a much older person. Doesn't have to be much older, but what I got is, yeah, probably much older. Like maybe eight years difference or something like that. But this person is younger. And they tend to run, they tend to ghost. You've looked at things in all different ways. You, It's obvious that, that you're hiding out. You're, you're not being seen by anybody. You're not being, you know, your friends are probably calling you up and saying, where the hell are you? Are you okay? But you're just doing a lot of time just thinking and thinking and looking at things differently. There's a lot of spiritual stuff going on in here for you. Like you're really, really going deep within. Because when I've got this really thinking about things and a spiritual card, it's something about a church, or it doesn't have to be the church, but the church within. And there's something... Holy crap. This is a Pisces who knows. You know that this is not your person. You, There's no doubt you have great passion for them. There's no doubt that you love them, but there, there is something that worries you about them coming back. You know that there's something that you're not seeing. You know. This is where I can't say Pisces. There's something that you don't see because you do see it. You're, you do see it, but you don't see it. You know what I mean? You do and you don't. And you worry about that chariot pulling up in the yard. There's there's some sort of imbalance here. There's some sort of confusion, confliction, something that puts you off. And I think you, you kind of know what it is. I think you're starting to see through the veil of what's happening here. Man, this is quite a reading. Oh, spirit, holy crap. Okay, so I have Pisces. Pisces, I think you offered up your house, your home. I, I believe that you did a lot here. I think because of the age difference that you might have actually gone overboard in doing things. You might even have tried to be their age. You might have maybe even tried to get them to become your age to, to be wiser in decisions. But when I got that, you're, you're looking at house and home, you're looking at options. I think you're starting to realize here, and I think you're trying to tell yourself the truth to walk away from this, which is probably why you're afraid to see them. Because if you see them, you're going to feel that, well, I, I, I kind of lost. And, and I'm going to go here with the inner house, the inner home. 
and knowing that you've got options, I think you just might lose that. You might lose that truth that you're telling yourself. Pisces. Well, Pisces is a very spiritual creature. Yeah, there's no doubt in my mind. Walking away and leaving it out in the cold. Look at those two cards. Bang, bang, right there. Walking away and leaving it out in the cold. This is the Pisces who, you know, picking up the sword, standing strong, making a judgment call. I've been there. I've done this shit. I, I, I can't do it anymore. I'm not a, a young person anymore, and I can't be playing these games. There was no equal give and take. This your, your person probably took a lot. You know, cross watchers, don't beat the crap out of me here. If it doesn't resonate, it's not your reading. That's to sort of click off now. But what I got here is there was no equal give and take. This person was nothing but a freaking nightmare to you. Nothing but a nightmare. Fighting, trying to fight. Fighting for what? Fighting for equal give and take. Fighting for understanding. Fighting for wisdom. Fighting for this young person who is definitely a runner. Ending. Death card. Ending. Spirit says pull one more card. Because with death there is renewal, but I, I really just don't see it here. I don't. But I could be wrong. You got some kind of communication coming in. We got a manifester here. And it doesn't have to be a manifester, it's just somebody that could just be thinking a lot. Thinking a lot, a lot, a lot, and they decide to get in touch with you. Because, no, they can't let it go. Holy shit. Okay, that's enough. Alright, so, I don't know what you're going to do with it after that. You just might just end up, keep on telling yourself the truth. Keep on keeping on. Get her on, get her done. I don't know. I just know that you got a great passion for this person. And um, now they can't let it go. Since you drew the sword and said, you know, this has been nothing but a damn nightmare. I'm walking away from this and before I change my mind. But there is a Pisces out there. And to tell if this is your reading, you're afraid to look out your window. You're afraid to look out your window. And you're, you want them to come back, but you don't want them to come back. You're afraid for them to come back. Because you just might go all the way back to step one when you feel like you're actually getting some answers right now. Cancer's first one out here. Um, Aries. Pisces. Sagittarius. Taurus. Aquarius. Aries. Taurus, Pisces, Gemini, Scorpio, Libra, Pisces, 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 oh crap, well, I hope you enjoyed the reading, I gotta go and start my day. Namaste.